I think it's safe to say that that one little item is gonna pay for this unit. Yes, that is a jackpot and that goes in my file. More facts on that, but I believe that's gonna pay for the unit. To Sony PS4, and they were a police officer maybe? That is beautiful. Very excited to find that. Enough talk, and I think it's safe to say we found well over $2,000. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, pirates of all ages, it's pirate time. We are here in the 200 and I believe 70 or $80 store. Dude, I bought this for one reason and one specific reason only. And that's because a little woman, she told me to get it. It's in the other place we just bought. If you remember, we bought the one at the Christmas decoration, same facility. Anyway, it's a 10 by 15. I wasn't the most fond of it. Wasn't my personal best, but the little woman liked it. So I said, screw it, let her roll the dice. And here we are, let's take a look. in here and let's see what we got so right off the bat is that's how i have to walk because of the angle of everything but there's another door here 10 by 15 so i'm guessing it's 15 feet wide and 10 feet deep it looks okay it doesn't look oh i see a motorcycle can there be a motorcycle in here oh there's two of them maybe it's something different interesting now i'm a little more intrigued by made in usa what is that anyway we're gonna get to it we're gonna see what's in here and we're gonna have some fun what do you guys think comment below what you think is in this storage unit the first thing we got is a suitcase that looks very unique oh, almost died you guys saw that right here what kind of tools do we got um oh there's 10 bucks proto craftsman master all right there's 10 10 bucks in sockets let's continue on what else do we got here can we get this out safely looks like we got a cot and then we've got what is this a suitcase of tools let's bring this in i'm kind of i get nervous when i go live on an unboxing because you don't know what you're gonna find in here i don't want to show you know, inappropriate things. Okay, we got paint, so that's cool. Ooh. What's that, 30, 40 bucks right there? I think that's 30, 40 bucks. That is a Makita. And then we got pieces of plastic. Ooh, all right, so come in here. I wonder what was in there. We got like a tool bag, like somebody's doing some work. A 12 inch. All right, I think I need one of those. I'm, I'm collecting tools because we will be eventually moving here soon. And in that process, I'm going to be creating a workshop because we're going to be changing kind of a different lifestyle, so to speak. So I don't own a lot of tools normally. And I feel like I'm going to be doing things like building. Oh, great. That's exactly what I was afraid of finding in here. No, OK, I thought that was a meth pipe. It wasn't. So we have a suitcase with a good 15 to 25 dollars in there. I like to be when I can straight up about the prices because a lot of times people think I can sell more than I can and then other times I can't make what people think I can. Okay, what is this? Oh, it's hollow and it's electric. That would have been cool. What the? Oh, wow. A rechargeable battery piece right there. Never seen that yet. So let's put that back in here. Go like that. That's a Vortex. And it looks like we got some chemicals, some things. I hate chemical boxes. Look at all this stuff leaned upside down. What kind of car did they drive? Ooh, that looks like they drove a nice car, a Ford F-150. Maybe we'll put that on eBay. I'm gonna set that aside. Hot shot, ant killer chemicals all right that is an ugly box not bad though i mean it, don't get me wrong there's 20 bucks in that box in my opinion okay if i pull out this the whole thing is gonna fall on me right what do we have in here oh, come on smash it smash the like button Ooh, they got that remy martin those are nice. Kumba. That's a good snow a snowshoe, right? That brand. That's good. Oh, I think I just dropped uh, something. We got a pair of those. Oh, nails. I'm guessing they were like a form of a contractor or something. They liked the Remy Martin. Oh, what's that? Sugar? Hmm. Okay. So, let's continue on. 
we've got a Holmes. What up, Holmes? I can tell you now, this is a kind of an ugly pack job. They had a boat. It, but it's like they threw their stuff in here, but at the same time, they kind of took care of their stuff. See how you look at the, the life jacket, and it's not all eaten up. Direct TV. Oh, yes. That I like, because I know somebody who wants this. Boom. Little woman, if you're watching, I might have referred to you. Oh yeah, great. We haven't found any masks in a while. <laughs> uh -huh. Okay, so that box is done. Looks like we have somebody who definitely loved the military, all right? Delta Zeta Party. At, no, this is college. I, why did I think that was military? I guess I was just reading it wrong. It's college. College stuff. Cold heart. I like that. I'm gonna keep that. Okay, we got masks. This looks like a little clothes type box. What kind of purse do we own? This is not bad though. Okay, I don't see anything of extravagance in there. First things first, I'm the realist. Okay, I'm just kidding. I always get song lyrics stuck in my head. How many people do that? You say like a word and then it reminds you of a song you heard not too long ago. Hmm, so Rockwell. I don't know what this does. It's a Sony crafter. It looks like this spins around and does some something, but I don't own one of these. And this I will end up keeping because I am building a tool set for when we move. And we got a roto zip. Um, probably sell that. Ooh, this is for my Rockwell. And this is for my Rockwell. So that will get kept. And we have one cool bag of tools. Now, continuing on. Okay. Just chargers for the DeWalt, but I might need that. And this is a bigger DeWalt charger. Don't know if we have the saw yet for that, but we'll see soon. That I like. It's small, but I don't know. Another Makita. Definitely paying for itself though, because see, look. We definitely have a lot of good items here. That right, between this and this, that's probably 30, 40 bucks plus that. Makes this an easy $50 bag in my opinion. That's in my opinion. What do I know? Looks like they did stuff in sheetrock. Hmm, I like that. I'm gonna keep that too. Okay. This is kind of a cool set, but sadly it's missing parts. I'm guessing this is like a $30 set maybe. I don't know, oh, it's Duralast. So he already lost the important parts and then pieced together a new set. Brilliant. Everybody say hello. You guys want your comments? You guys want your comments to be on my uh, video? Cause it's recording right now? Say something. Everybody type right now, something pretty. Say something pretty right now and you will actually be in the next video, your comment. No? Hi, okay. Hey, hey. Nice pirate, hello. Look at that, Mark, Bonnie, Pandera, Queen, Trish. Graydon says, hi YouTube. Fernando says, hustle, grind, rewind. It's not a motto, it's a way of life. That's the, that's priceless. What's up? We're definitely finding sellable items like what? That's eight, 10 bucks. That is five to seven bucks easily. And I'm being conservative. And then here is another $5 bill. So it's what, like 20 bucks in my hand. Every trip I take out here to the trailer becomes like a $20 bill. So it's not so far it turned out to be some landslide of a storage unit, but it was cheap and it's going to be instant profit. Mm. That's all right. I see a couple of tools. These are always cool for when you're doing recycling. I might actually keep those because I don't have a good pair of those. And we had bad breath. All right. And a fan. Nice. That's 30 bucks. Maybe more. Maybe 40. I'm uncertain, but definitely a $30 bill. Those I usually get 30 bucks for every one of those. Biter off of me. Oh, that is, I don't know. 25 bucks, kind of cute. Uh, it's a little bit dilapidated, but we will go ahead and we will try to sell that anyway. So being as we have a lot to do today, we're gonna do quick gander between the boxes and then move on to the next. See what we got. Okay, so right off the bat, they had drank keto, so they were worried about health. And they had clean stuff. Knife set, the sharper image. I don't see any Cutco or anything, but still. 
we have a pool stick. Thomas. And then it's just basic kitchen stuff. So we'll just, oh, they drank tequila. This is the kind that uh, my good friend Alex likes, but it's open. All right, that's the box. All right, so we have some type of toy. Incredible Hulk. We have some cool figures here. We have a beetle. Dig in a little deep. We have ooh, Transformer. Hot. Hot wheels. Maybe set some of these aside. Or what do you guys think? Hot wheels seem to be hot when it comes to auctions, so those are kind of cool toys. I can't set all the toys aside. The Elite. All right, nice little toy box. That's gotta be a good 20, 20, 30 bucks right there. So far, we're just digging in here. One thing I like is that raw door. I think it's safe to say that that one little item is gonna pay for this unit. Not bad. When we open them up, we got something cool like, whoa. These are a few bucks here. I don't know if they're special, but they're definitely some cool different colors. So we have, yes, that is a jackpot and that goes in my pile. Legos, big windows. So looks like a lot of toys in here. Newer toys. I always go through these type of toys once we get into the flea market and people's piles come and I like to take a look at what they got. So we'll probably get more in depth there with that. But for now, we're just gonna go through the box. I like that. Champs, extra large dibs. Size 13, maybe a knockoff, but still very, very nice. <laughs> Size 13, look at that. Oh yes, come on, come on, come on, come on. So far I haven't seen much women's stuff in here, so I'm, I'm not sure. Oh, it's a freaking air bed. Clickbait, and another pair of these, or the other half of those, so those are good shoes. And then we have this shoe here, and this shoe here. Those look kind of comfy. So that's kind of cool. And a keyboard that goes to the Logitech's computer system. And then clothes. We have some good clothes. What do we have? All right, I don't like that. Okay. A decent little kitchen box. All the little things that everybody buys off me for a dollar a piece, two dollars a piece. Um, what in there? Oh, yeah. Okay, wrap. Nope, junk. Uh, we have here little plates. Okay. These people are really packed well though. Chung Nam, that's actually kind of nice. Almost want to save that for Alameda. Let's see what else is in here. Uh, a clear vase. All right. Things like this, I'm just going to uh, take like it is. I don't really see a lot of, those are kind of cool because they're electricians with the heavy duty, but it's all food. I don't like going through that. Nice. Not bad. I don't know if they're in whole, I'll probably sell these ones right here. They're in good shape. Like, I don't know why all of a sudden this week we became like canopy dealers and we have, this is the, okay, we bought two of them. And that's why I hate doing this. Like, look, I told a little woman if we buy them, they're going to be found in the coming weeks. Sure as crap, we got two here. We got two in the last unit she bought, and that makes six now because we have the two we purchased ourselves from Walmart. Nice, nice, nice. That's a good 75 bucks right there in Milwaukee. This one, I like this one. I'm gonna keep this one as well, because this one's long, like, this is like, uh, it's actually over my height. So we're gonna keep that one quarter table. I don't know if this is better than the one that I kept already, so we might end up keeping this one as well and get rid of the other one. I might keep both, but I've been saving stuff like this. 
Now, for the big show and tell. This is kind of tight. I don't know what year it is. I don't know nothing about it. It doesn't even have a chain. It's the lowrider version. And it is, oh, lowrider. It needs that. This might be a good one. Okay, let's see here. Let's come out here in the light. Let's come take a look at you in the light. Low ride to go get a little something faster. I like that. I don't know what that's worth. It's made by Lowrider. It's made to look like a Schwinn. I will have to get some more facts on that, but I believe that's going to pay for the unit. To Sony PS4. That is probably what? I don't know. 60, 80 bucks, maybe 100. Uncertain. I haven't found one of those in a while, so I don't know the price of them currently. I'm going to find out before the end of the day. Got a new controller as well. Let's adjust this over here. Then we got more personal. We got. Holy smokes. He was a boat racer. Ooh, Harley Davidson limited edition playing cards. They are very limited in their edition. Okay. We got a whole pair of those, size 13. I believe those are got to be 100 bucks right there. And then we have this, which I have no idea what it is. Um... So unbelievable that I brought a knife. I brought two of them this morning. I had two of them in my in my pocket where I keep my knives, and they have both disappeared since the start of this unit and all I've done today. Okay, personal, 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 and then more weights. Okay, that was weird. And oh man, they liked garbage football teams. Okay, so that says a lot official baseball yeah so there's nothing i thought there was going to be something cool in here crap on a stick michael that is weird then i thought i just saw a thing for the low riders and then i gotta flip through here again okay so they built refineries maybe they owned a harley and they were a police officer, maybe? Wow, this story's getting more and more interesting. Then they got a Kiwi Marsh Landing. That looks like a cool belt buckle. And then, that's it. All right. Continuing on. That's cool. It's been a long time since I won a tool bag. I swear I'm keeping this for the house. I like it because they say we're going to be out doing work and stuff and I'm going to have my tools on me and things like that. I actually used to wear one of those. One of my first jobs. I don't discuss all my jobs that I have, but I've done everything. I've worked at Burger King, Subway, and Taco Bell on the same day. I've been an electrician. I used to dig ditches for low voltage lighting in yards. I used to do swimming pool illumination with fiber optics. I was a furniture mover for over 15 years. Um, I've always had one of those, uh, you only got one job, man. I got four jobs when I was, that was me, always. But regardless, I used to do stuff like that. Ah. Empty box, clickbait. He had nice shirts and I could use this one, an extra large, so I'm gonna put that in my pile. Cause I like just, oh yeah, a large. I could use that, it's all black. These are good work shirts. Another one. All right, that was the whole box there. Let's see if we could fill that up. Look at that, size 34 shorts. I will keep these for myself because uh, I have lost a lot of weight. Actually, it's a whole thing of brand new shirts. Wow. I'm probably gonna keep all these. I'm probably gonna keep all those. I like to do so. Let's bring this down here like this. Let's see what we got. It is heavy. Plus, it's empty right there. Nice little swivel ratchet heads. I wish I had. Maybe I could find the rest of those because I kind of like that set. 
voltage tester. Uh, this is a jack. Mm, an icon. It looks like just a lot of good, decent hand tools. Um, nothing that I feel I need to keep in here. Alright, so yeah. I would say that's an easy 50 bucks. Comment below if you do better on tools, but this is not like snap on, it's not full sets. But I think there's at least 50. There could be more though. Don't quote me, maybe 100. I like to be reasonable. Okay. Oh, another one of these. We got a couple of these. These are a little cheaper ones, Husky. But I would still consider that a good 30, 40 bucks. I kind of like that actually. It's cheap though, otherwise I would probably keep that. And some tie downs. I'd say another, oh, with the extension cord and the nails and the screwdriver, I'd say that's another 40. Maybe a, actually with the bag, I'm saying 75 right here. Let's say 75 on that. Oh, interesting. Uh, this is not probably the bestest pressure washer right here. I'd say this is, I'll have to look it up, hyper tough. But the funny thing is the little woman's been wanting a pressure washer and I am too cheap to just go around buying stuff because I buy storage units. So I told her, just wait, wait, babe, we're gonna find one. Woman, if you're watching my video, which I don't know if you are, um, first thing, um, you're the most beautiful woman in the world, and I've loved you since the very moment I've ever laid eyes and introduced myself to you the day you became the manager of my storage facility. But with that being said, you picked a winner. Good unit, you bought two, both of them are gonna make us profit. And you're getting things you want because you got the cricket thing over there for the iron. And look at this. And now we got a pressure washer. Shout out to you, my love. This isn't bad. A little next grill. Nothing. It's not nothing special. But, you know, you camp a lot. This might be kind of cool versus the traditional way you do it. I'm going to have to look into that. It's a little dirty, but I like that. I mean, we're getting down to it. We got stuff coming out. I don't know what the wheels go to. If you guys do, let me know, but it'll probably be too late. But I got a TV stand. I think I have the glass. Nice, sharp television. We've got sellable beds. The couch is looking great. There's more furniture coming out. And we're about to hit a tool lick here again. I like a nice... Ooh. Wow. 4,000 watt amp. Interesting. Okay. And we got a barbecue. It's just coming out. I mean, that's like, what, 50 bucks right there, I guess. All right, so what do we have here? We got a football from ESPN, signed by nobody, but it's cool. We've got a rigid. That's kind of cool. It's an aluminum one. I'm going to probably keep that because I like that better than the steel. Ooh, yes. We got that drill. We got some chargers. The, that right there is 40 bucks between the drill and the chargers easily. And then we got this one. And then we got the battery. So does the battery even work? Mm, this is not the right one. All right. But that's cool. I'm very happy about that. So we got at least 50, 60 bucks right there. Then we... Screws. All right. Nothing, nothing too extravagant there. Just some little bit of stuff. Some last minute stuff. Look at that. That would be kind of cool to put in. Imagine that in front of all your tires to pick up all the screws. Okay. So... I think there's about a hundred bucks here with the cart, just because of the cart. Another porter cable, there's 30 more dollars. Ooh, the Walt Roto Zip, there's another $20. And we got some of these. And something for uh, mincing garlic too. So that's pretty cool. And that makes that a cool little bag. Another 60, 50, 70 dollar bag of stuff. All right, so that is pretty cool right there. Now I have what I believe to be a two, three hundred dollar TV. I have the same TV, I believe, um, in my house. I bought this a few years ago. I paid four grand when they first came out, but they've dropped in price. But nonetheless, that is beautiful. Very excited to find that. We're getting this pretty much wrapped up. I hate doing this because you have to, but you just got to be careful. It's the only way to really dolly these right when you lay it on it. on end here. Solo YOLO, right? It's how you gotta do it when you're by yourself. But if you do it just right and don't and do not do any real sliding around, it'll be all right. Just come back and make sure you didn't get any rocks because once you come up, you're gonna slide it around. So, seems to be a lot of stuff in this unit. 
my quick recap is this sofa set i'm going for 400 400 tomorrow i could probably do better online but then i also move it to my storage make the ad wait meet people etc etc at the flea market quite sure i'm coming home with 400 on this tomorrow little woman score she bought this for 280 so i'm not going to be mad we did a great job she got her nephew an amazing bed thanks uh shout out to everybody commenting in the video on the live tell me about the bed i'm sorry but it's not for sale because the little woman uh her nephew and uh sister moved in to a new apartment and he needed a bed so poof she got him a nice bed i love that the fact that hey well others um she's learning the same way i am now uh you get to find stuff in storages and it, it is uh you save money right that's the beauty of it anyway i'm gonna wrap this up enough talking i think it's safe to say we found well over two thousand dollars in this storage unit let's recap let's recap sofa minimum 400 bed free that bike right there i still haven't figured out what come what the value is but it is officially made by lowrider so i'm gonna guess three to five hundred without seeing any more information could be more so that puts us at almost 800 big tv at least 300 on the big one now we're over a thousand another 200 we're at 13. you factor in there's there's woo this is well over 2000 shout out to the little woman god there's so many reasons i love you i guess if you like this video guys uh don't forget the like button share button subscribe and say something pretty like uh little woman another unit wrapped up another unit wrapped up almost done here. and just like that we are done for the day we are going to wrap this up we are going to go home and call it well actually we're going to go back to our storage we're going to take uh the sister's bed off and then we are going to top off for the next day because we need an empty room in our storage like whoa